Alexandra here if you are new. What it do, baby? Yeah. If you are a returning subscriber. What's up, cuz? What's up? So in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my updated curly hair routine for my type 4 low porosity and heat damaged hair. The last time I did a video like this was in 2019. I've updated some of the products I use and how I do it. So I wanted to show you guys that today. If you're interested in seeing how I got my hair like this, just keep on watching. Oh. This is my hair. Um, I did the maximum hydration method that I saw only one Jess do in her video. I put it up here somewhere so y'all know who I'm talking about. Y'all, my hair has never looked this good getting out the shower. I'm trying to figure out why I didn't know about applying my leave-in in the shower before now. Okay. Y'all, it is hot. So I apologize about the background noise. I have the air on. I'm burning up as you can see. I am sweating. Tangler brush through it first. Like I said, I already applied my leave-in conditioner. For my styling cream now, I use the Texture ID uh, styling cream. And I'm gonna run back through with my detangler to clump my curls together. Of course, you know, I'm using the Extreme Gel. The shingling method is basically when you slightly twist and smooth each strand of hair. This helps maximize the definition of your natural curl pattern. This is how we are looking. I'm going to speed it up this next section and then I'll come back when it's time to do my heat damaged curls. section is a bit different so I'm going to take this piece here and twist it a few times and pull Let's see So you're probably wondering what's the difference between me shingling earlier and what I'm doing now. What I'm doing now is finger coiling. So that actually creates a coil or a curl. Um, this part of my head is wavy. It doesn't really curl at all. So this helps enhance definition and give it an actual pattern. So 
And this is what we have. This is what it looks like on this side. Now, this side I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna just let it play. I'm not gonna talk through this side because I don't really have any damage. Same thing I did in this back section that doesn't have any damage, I'm gonna do on this side, so yeah. So I've let it air dry for the most part. Now I'm gonna use my blow dryer with the diffuser attached to it so that I can get my roots dry and then scrunch for volume. I have tried it to the best of my ability that I want to fro so I'm going to be picking my hair to get the desired shape I want. Pick at the root and up. a faux bang just because I don't have it so I'm going to push this back like so just that little section it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it and of course if you made it this far then you already know baby girl we're family hey auntie so cousin i'm gonna need you to go ahead and like comment and subscribe also hit that bell so you can turn on your post notifications and be notified every single time i upload i love you guys and i will see you in my next video and goodbye period i mean it